Well, the job of the nose tackle is pretty simple, but it's complicated at the same time. You know, I have to be aggressive every play. We always have to work together, you know, just making calls, relaying calls to the ends, making sure we're always on the same page. Without the nose tackle, everything else falls apart. The reason you have great linebackers and a lot linebackers are allowed to flow are because they're being held up. He has worked extremely hard off the field uh, to become the strongest player on our football team. And with the position that he plays being a, a nose tackle, uh, that is critical. And what he's done to be able to control centers and make people double team him has uh, made him a valuable asset to our defense. I mean, weight room, I think that's the most important thing. You know, everything starts the weight room, you know. Luckily, I had a high school coach who stressed that through, uh, in me all throughout high school, and uh, I carried that into, uh, into my college game. With them being the leading rushing team in the conference and uh, over four games, they've been able to run the football against their opponents, which puts them in a position to win football games. It's something that we have to control the line of scrimmage on both sides of the football if we're going to have a chance to uh, come out of here with a victory. Everybody was focused, everybody was, there was a lot of attention to detail. Guys were having fun, but it wasn't getting too wacky. Um, they were all driven on what we were doing out there. We had three excellent practices last week, and the energy has been fantastic. So they're, I think they're completely back. I think they're looking forward to the Pioneer League opener. I think the mindset is very good, and we, we know that we're starting at 0-0 zero zero right now. We have eight opportunities coming up starting here with Campbell in opportunity number one.